Welcome to the MTech training video series. MTech Inc. is an accredited independent laboratory engaged in food, water, and environmental testing. Located in the San Francisco Bay Area, we are a proud provider of analytical solutions, consultation, research, and training services to the food and beverage companies, environmental consultants, and industrial hygienists around the U.S. This video will demonstrate how to perform active air sampling using the impaction method. This method separates particles from the airstream using a pump to force their deposition onto a solid surface. Here is the Buck Bioculture Pump. It is a bioaerosol sampling pump designed to draw air onto a standard agar plate. The sampling pump is available for rental at the Amtec online store. The sampling kit includes a pump, a calibration head with a meter, a sampling head, a user manual, and an electric charger. Prior to sampling, please read the user manual thoroughly and familiarize yourself with the instructions. Be sure to charge the pump fully prior to sampling. You will also need 90 millimeter agar plates. Use triptych soy agar or blood agar plates for bacterial sampling and malt extract agar plates for fungal sampling. You can also use other types of media to fit the purpose of your project. You may also need additional materials such as Ziploc bags, disposable gloves, an alcohol-based spray, and an insulated cooler box with ice packs for shipping. Put on gloves before handling any microbiological samples. Use the alcohol spray to disinfect the sampling head before and between each use. The pump should be calibrated before each sampling. To calibrate, screw the calibrator with the attached head and pressure gauge onto the pump. Push on, then press cal for two seconds to put the pump into calibration mode. Adjust the flow rate using the up and down keys to the desired millimeter of water pressure to achieve the correct flow per minute. Correlate with the calibration chart on the side of the gauge. When the flow rate is achieved, push cal to accept the setting. Then turn the pump off. Verify the flow rate with the calibration head by selecting a 1, 2, 5, or 10 minute timing route. Press the off key to stop. If the verification flow is accurate, entering cal is not necessary. Please note, entering the cal mode removes the previous setting to allow for a new flow rate. Place the pump in the desired location. Open a 90 millimeter agar plate and place the plate within the mount. Then screw the sampling head back on. Push the on button, then press one of the one, two, five, or 10 minute keys for an automatic time sampling. At the end of the program sampling period, the pump will automatically shut off and the complete LED will be lit. Unscrew the head and remove the agar plate. Close the plate and seal it with scotch tape. Label the bottom of the plate with a unique ID, location, and date. Then record the flow rate, time, and amount of air sampled on the chain of custody form. Pack the plates into plastic Ziploc bags and place the bags as well as the COC form inside a cooler box with ice packs. Do not use dry ice. Ship the samples preferably on the same day of collection, but no later than 24 hours after sampling to the following address. MTech Inc. Environmental Lab, 466 Cato Terrace, Fremont, California, 94539. Please note that damaged samples will not be processed. Thank you for watching this video. If you find this training video helpful, please subscribe to our channel to receive notifications on future videos. Please contact us at lab at mtech.com or 510-979-1979. For more information about MTech and our services, please visit www.mtech.com.